All right, we got another quick garden tour. Just loving that sky. So, here is my favorite spot again. Yep. And my cucumber is taking off like a rocket. It's doing great. This is Armenian cucumber medi version, the darker green type. Amaricas, peppers that I got from Star Nursery. These ones are doing awesome. Sun Gold, doing decent. I pruned tons of suckers off him. He's hanging in there pretty well. And then we planted zinnias and here they come. So we'll have to I always plant two or three just in case some don't work. So we'll take one out. And then I'm still sticking in love with this grid. I'm waiting for a part to come in the mail that will regulate the water. It's blasting the water way too much. And so I put this part here and then I turn the knob and it will decrease the water blasting. This whole bed is gonna have a garden grid eventually. I just need to sell some more dressers. <laughs> But got a little bit of peppers. Puny, puny pepper plants. They're not really that impressive, but they are giving me a couple nice pieces of pepper. Okay, so here's our little flower section. This is the Angelonia Summer Snapdragon. It's supposed to get way bigger. This is Verbena. It's more like a ground cover type of plant. And then Vinca, which is so pretty next to the orange marigold. And then a Costco chair. <laughs> the best chairs from Costco. These little cute chairs that are so sturdy. And once again, my very, very favorite, my Tacoma Stands Yellow Bells. And now they produce a ton of leaves and they give me a lot of debris. And I'm starting to learn about composting. So now it's giving me gold. <laughs> it's uh, leaves. This is my shed. I am so thankful. Our neighbor was moving and gave it to us. I love it when people move and give away their junk. It's great. So we put it to good use. I went shopping yesterday in the shed. <laughs> I didn't realize that I would bought um, worm castings, which that's gold right there. And there, that is the, one of the best stuff you can put in your garden. I had this huge bag of seedling mix bought this before I realized I was going to get into growing seeds again. Got all my leftover irrigation pipes, tons of shade cloth, handy bucket. So I love my shed. Okay, so I have a new project. I've been wanting to master composting forever. I finally decided to do it. Um, I'm following Angela's instructions. So Arizona Garden Lady. She has a great video on her channel for simple composting. She makes it look like anyone can do this. And I figured we throw out so much food waste and I cut up so much plants and, you know, so I'm just gonna do it, finally. Cause you can't buy compost really well at stores and compost is the best gold crumbly earth you can put into your bed. So I really wanna tackle this. Here we have my cute boy. Hi, cute boy. Quack. <laughs> Quack. So, these are my two composting bins. Now, you I just don't, said that. I know. I'm showing it. I'm showing it now. Well, now you get to show and say the whole thing over again. Oh, I'm such a wise, wise boy. <laughs> so, one of them will be for the actual composting. Here's the one for the leaves. I believe green matter? No, brown. Brown. There's brown material and green material. I'm still learning this. So you can use trash cans, which she has in her video. This is what I have right now. I need to drill some holes in the box. Sticking her plane. Wow. Wow, in the meantime, let's look at these clouds. Oh my goodness. Don't you just love the desert sky? Oh, that's beautiful. So yes, we need to drill some holes and we'll be good to go. Here's our cute homemade uh, sandbox we made a long time ago. Anytime we put new sand in here, everyone goes nuts. It's great. Okay, prime real estate again for growing. So I have this trellis here and, oh, hi kitty. There's our kitty. <laughs> I have a trellis Whoa! that Nothing. we could grow stuff up. I want to grow tomatoes, cucumbers. I want to use this big time. Here's all my leftover tomato cages. Whoa. Hob says, good morning. I'm here, I'm taking over the bathroom. <laughs> 
By the way, this is probably one of the best wheelbarrows you can get. I got this at Lowe's. It's all about this sturdy, sturdy tire in the front. Very, very good one. I got that years ago. Anyways, these cattle panels, or uh, concrete mesh, they're not cattle panels. These are $10 a piece. So Whoa, I want to... <laughs> I want to put them to good use. So This one's better. <laughs> no, I don't think so. <laughs> I do. Oh, goodness. So we're going to open these up and we're going to hang Aww. them from the top. And our stinking cat just wants to escape all the time. He's like, how do I bust out? It's crazy. <laughs> Anyways, we're going to hang them. Yes, the cat's like trying to steal the show. And we're going to grow stuff going up and down because there is a pipe right there that I can attach to. So anyways, that's the gist of it. I have not been able to sit still for the past two months in gardening. I've just been seeing things that can be improved and changing things and tweaking it up. And that's the fun part of gardening. You can always change, rotate plants, do new plans. It's awesome. It is the best to grow in the desert here.